Welcome to IRG's Sports Injury Update. I'm with Shannon O'Kelly, physical therapist and president of IRG Physical and Hand Therapy. And our guest, Dr. Linnea Welton, sports medicine and hip preservation surgeon with Multicare. Dr. Welton is also a team physician with the Seattle Rain. Dr. Welton, welcome. Tell us about hip impingement. Hip impingement is a bony conflict between the socket and the ball of the hip joint. A lot of people that stop, start, cut, move lateral? Yes. Either extremes of motion or cutting, pivoting, twisting activities can elicit pain because of the restricted motion that the bony shape induces. Signs and symptoms? Most common signs and symptoms are front of the hip groin pain, often associated with catching and clicking sensation. How do you fix it? We initially try and treat it with uh, conservative management like physical therapy to strengthen the muscles around the hip joint. Sometimes injections like corticosteroids versus PRP, which is short for platelet-rich plasma. But oftentimes high-end athletes or athletes in general need to have a hip arthroscopy surgery done, which is an outpatient surgery. And that surgery allows us to repair the damaged tissue like the labrum or the cartilage. And it allows us to recontour the bony abnormality so no longer do they impinge or confirm conflict with one another. What about return to play? Can be as short as three to four months. However, athletes, patients start biking either the night of surgery or the day after surgery. It's a very constant rehab protocol that we've developed. The outcomes are excellent. Most uh, athletes and patients get back to their level of sport within three to four months. Dr. Welton, thank you. If you have any questions regarding hip injuries, you can contact Dr. Welton at multicare.org. That's multicare.org. With over 40 neighborhood clinics around Washington, IRG has you covered. Let IRG be your family's physical therapist. Find the location nearest you at IRGPT.com. That's IRGPT.com.